What time is it? Aki bento time! Yay! That was so cheesy. This month's theme of June was spirits. Let's bleach figurine. It says yes anime. Shonen Jump Bleach. Um, Khan. So he's like the little spirit guy who uh, is inside of a little cute lion um, plushie here. It's to my figurines here. I'm gonna put it up on the tap. Up on the tap. Ooh! I got a little box here. So these are like the little uh, puffy spirits from Spirit of the Way. Ah, it's a keychain! Little tiny keychain of the puffy spirits. Spirit thingy from Spirit Away. Ah! All I loved about watching Spirit Away was when these little uh, creatures, um, they're just like walk, you know, trying to take the rocks and then throw it in the fire, and then they just, you know, eat the little candies. The Black Butler series, Sebastian. Sebastian. I'm one hell of a butler. If you haven't seen the series of the Black Butler. Um, I guess it's like pretty much a fan service for the girls. Even though they don't really do anything together uh, with uh, the butler and his master uh, CL. Um, you know, people kind of, you do a lot of uh, fan fix, um, And you know, we hook them up together. Yeah. Agi Bento exclusive. Uh, I'm kind of curious what this is. I, I cannot tell. It's like shaking. Open it. Oh. D crystal meth. What? Wait. What? How does this work? How is this LED? The twist a cap, turn on the light, twist it? <gasps> this is cool! This is a scythe. I'm guessing this is from Soul Eater. Amaka um, scythe. I'm blinging! This is cool! So I have a t shirt here. T shirt. Spirit Reaper. And you have Maka. Um, and then in the backdrop or the background of her silhouette is like kind of like this galaxy kind of pattern. It reminds me of the opening song. First, what's the opening? Like, it just got me so pumped up. You have all these characters like popping up. And in terms of the graphic, it was very, it, it stood out so much. It was very poppy. Uh, the colors were very like solid. The line work was very like clean and crisp. It just, so much kick-ass um, action scenes. It's really cool to watch. Date a lie? Or date alive? I don't even know how you pronounce it. Over here of all the characters, the female characters. Here. The group. If you look inside, you have a, uh, yeah, like a normal notebook. You have, you know, in the little corner page, uh, the characters. And you have another character here. I never watched this anime. But judging by all these female characters, um, this is definitely like, one of those fan servers anime, isn't it? <laughs> or at least a harem or something. Like. Spirit Akibento. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm not. I'm not sure what this spirit is, but this is a spirit from Spirit of the Way. I forgot the character's name, but the character from Hero Academia. And it's a very cute character too. Again, the YouTuber Roger Base. Yeah, I guess I'll check him out. <laughs> Spirits. Ooh. I, I kind of expected more of thing. Supernatural? I'm just saying Akibendo, but Yu Yu Hakusho. Not just saying, I'm not just saying it because like, Yu Yu Hakusho is my favorite anime or anything, but just like Spirit Detective, you know, Spirit Gun, Spirit Sword. Anime kind of brings up, you know, a lot of the spiritual kind of themes. And um, it's not necessarily what, for me personally, like I, this is how the spiritual things will look like, but it's kind of fun to picture. Um, it's you know, it is an adventure. It is something you know, like kind of interesting, cool. Like you see a lot of action. It kind of leads people into this world where they don't imagine to be in. One example, Bleach. Um, Ichigo is a regular high school student. Didn't think much about it until he was sucked into this kind of spiritual, you know, like battle between the Shinigami, the Reaper, and um, the Hollow, like the the like the creature like the evil um dark creature so it's just kind of showing my stuff like kind of like god just brings me into a place where i don't expect it's a lot of times where it's super inconvenient or it's a lot of times where it's just like whoa what just happened i don't even like expect this to happen it's crazy because it comes ends up becoming this whole like little adventure or it's kind of for me personally like a journey um similar to like ichigo it's just like 
whoa, what happened? And then it's, oh, whoa, like, this is real. Like, it's, like, real for me. I think when you find what's real for you, what your truth is, it's just, like, it becomes this whole new uh, perspective. You become open to this new world. It's kind of like this another realm that you don't see. One of those things people, you know, it's a lot of people just miss by like even for me like I'm like oh maybe it's too good to be true it seems imaginary it's not real a lot of people bypass it it's so easy to do that and the good reason because it's one of those things you can't see physically you can't see it it's something eternal like it goes on like you know like it's always constant it's forever I'm gonna let you guys know is like, I am Christian and I might just bring some you know some of my, share some of my beliefs into some of the videos here. I don't push people to certain places they don't want to be. I mean, like, you know, if I ever do, let me know. I'm not forcing you guys to, like, oh, believe in it. This is what it is, you know? Like, I think for me, like, I know, like, my own journey, like, it's what you take of it and what you believe in it. I want to share what I want to share, and this is why it is. So if you feel offended, I can't say much. <laughs> Uh, if you feel offended, I don't, know, I don't know what to say. I'm down to whatever beliefs you believe in. I'm like, you could believe in that. That's cool. I think for me, one thing, I'm just like, yo, respect. I respect your whatever you believe in. Respect what I believe in, please. Just to let you guys know, I'm just not a pushover. It might be nice to you because I just want to respect people. Every individual, I want to respect them. I think for me, I feel like people should deserve, like, you know, like some kindness. But if you push that boundary, if you go across that line, don't expect me to not be angry. Like, I'm going to be angry. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, I'm just kind of sharing a little bit of, of myself and what I take of the whole spirit. Like, being. Bye, guys. Psh.